Today we're going to take a look at a challenge that I hit uh, for modifying a single item uh, in a particular form. So let's say over here we have our pitch speed, right, which we can easily type in a number uh, and hit submit. So if I go ahead and save a pitch speed. But this text is pretty fine, small, and if you're filling this in, uh, it's the most important piece of data uh, of the three fields we collect. So wouldn't it be nice if we could just make this bigger and, and more easy for, easier for the user to see what they type, almost kind of overtly large, um, because it is the key thing that they need to enter. So what we're going to look at today is how do you do that? So first of all, um, obviously we could go in and, and modify the style components individually, um, but I found that that's a little clunky at times. So instead, what I would advise is to look at uh, three things. You see here, you've got an ID. Uh, this, the item name is P9 speed. And you see, you've got an item for container. You've got a P9 speed item uh, for the, the, the name here, uh, which is actually uh, the, the text value that goes in. Um, and then there's also a container uh, for the label P9 speed underscore label. So we're going to show you how to real easily go into the page CSS and uh, simply use the pound. So you look for modifying the element with the ID. And in this case, we're going to add, reduce the padding at the top so it tucks up closer uh, to the LOV above. We're going to increase the size of the font label. Uh, this would be where it says pitch speed. Um, and for the actual number that's typed in, uh, we're going to increase the size of the box and the size of the font. So I'm going to go ahead and hit save here. We add this up at the page level. Uh, and then we can go back here, hit refresh. And we can see now it's much easier for the person to see and, and type in uh, and enter additional additional speeds with, with the larger text area. Uh, and so this would be the case for anything that you wanted to modify on the page. You can see here my item name is actually P9 speed. Um, we could do the same thing if we wanted to modify the pitch type or the pitch date or, or any items uh, in, in the page on the form. 